Hello, hello, hello! May give a shout out to all the subscribers and followers of this channel. Especially to all my students and their parents. And may give a shout out to all the students all over the world. Especially to all the Filipino students here in the Philippines. Thank you so much uh, for always supporting my channel. And if you are new to my channel, please... One subscribe to like share. Don't forget to ring the bell buttons for the next notification. Three like leave a comment subscribe for subscribe all right our lesson for today is about polyhedron and this will be explained in Filipino and English. So our objectives illustrate three-dimensional geometric figures called polyhedrons and use the freedom God has bestowed on us intellectually. Okay, so we have polyhedrons. What is a polyhedron? Alright, so these are polyhedrons. So these are polyhedrons and these are not polyhedrons. Remember, circles are not polygons. Identifying polyhedrons. A polyhedron is a solid that is bounded by polygons called faces that enclosed a single region of space. An edge of a polyhedron is a line segment formed by intersection of two faces. A vertex of a polyhedron is a point where three or more edges meet. Okay, parts of a polyhedron. Okay, so this is the face, the vertex, and the edges or the edge. Okay, example one. So let counting faces, vertices, and edges. Okay, let's count the faces, vertices, and edges of each polyhedron. All right, so we have A, B, and C. All right, let's count this. One, two, three, four. There are four faces. Yes. Next. Let's count the vertices. One, two, three, four. Okay, this there, this there are four vertices. And then let's count the edges. So we have six. So one, two, three, four, five, six. All right, next. Example, letter B. Okay, so we have five faces. No? So, next. Uh, let's count the vertices. So, three, four, five. Yes, there are five vertices. And then, let's count the edges. One, two, three, four. So, we have... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Alright. Next. Okay. Another example. Okay. How many? There are 6 faces. Okay. For this example. And then, let's count the edge. Ayan. There are six vertices. 
Okay, next. Ah, this time edge na talaga. Yan, ilan yan? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So, there are 10 edges. Edges, edges. Okay. Now, notice the pattern. So, if we have 4 faces, there are also 4 vertices. And the edge is 6. Now, if we have 5 faces, there are also 5 vertices and 8 edges. If we have 6 faces, there are also 6 vertices and 10 edges. Okay. Next. From Theorem to Observe 1 from Euler's Theorem. Yeah. So, perhaps you know who is Euler. Uh, the number of faces, or F, vertices V and the edges E of a polyhedron is related by F plus V equals E plus 2. And so let's have more about polyhedrons. Okay. The surface of a polyhedron consists of all points on its face or its faces. And a polyhedron is convex. If any two points on its surface can be connected by a line segment that lies entirely inside or on the polyhedron. Yeah, okay. So these polyhedrons are convex and these are not convex, no? Right. So we have regular polygons. Okay, a polyhedron or a regular polyhedrons. A polyhedron is irregular if all its faces are congruent regular polygons. So, kapag regu uh, congruent regular polygons, so regular polyhedrons sa tawag sa kanya. Okay, so we have here, these polyhedrons are convex. Na? But, this one is regular, then this one is not regular because vertices are not formed by the same number of faces. Five kinds of regular polyhedrons. Okay, so we have regular tetrahedron. And so it has four faces. Next, we have cube. Cube has six faces. Regular octahedron, so it has eight faces. And then we have regular dodecahedron, which has 12 faces. And the regular ecosahedron, which has 20 faces. Alright, so example to classify polyhedrons. Okay, one of the octahedrons is regular, which is it. Okay. So, a polyhedron is regular if all its faces are congruent, regular polygons. So, let's see which is of this are the regular octahedrons. Alright, here. All its faces are congruent equilateral triangles and each vertex is formed by the intersection of four faces. And the letter B, faces are not congruent and regular hexagons and squares. No? And the faces here are not all regular polygons or congruent. So these are trapezoids and triangles. So the answer is letter A because uh, lahat ng ano niya, na faces niya, mukha niya, pareho ang sukat. No? Next. So, example 3, counting the vertices of a soccer ball. A soccer ball has 32 faces, 20 are regular hexagons, and 12 are regular pentagons. How many vertices does it have? Okay. A soccer ball is an example of semi-regular polyhedron, one whose faces are more than one type of regular poly polygon and whose vertices are all exactly the same. Okay, so um, let's count example 3 counting the vertices of soccer ball. So, um, a soccer ball 
has 32 faces, 20 are regular hexagons, and 12 are regular pentagons. How many vertices does it have? Hexagon, we have 6 sides, and pentagon, 5 sides. No? Each edge of the soccer ball is shared by 2 sides. Total number of edges, of course, so from the formula, so we have 6 times 20 plus 5 times 12. Yes, no? And then, so that is equal to 1 half because 6 times 20 is 120 plus 5 times so 60 is 180. 180 divided by 2 is 90. And then, now use Euler's theorem, which is F plus B is equal to E plus 2. So, 32, which is 32 faces, plus V is equal to 90 plus 2. Now, paano natin kukunin yan? So, we could say that B is equal to 92 minus 32. That's why the vertices is equal to 60. Alright? That's it. Question. So, for questions and clarifications, just write it at the comment section. And before I go, I would like to thank everyone for all your support. And dear students, please go back to the playlist of our lessons for the third quarter. Happy answering your worksheets. No, love you all. And before I go... One, subscribe, two, like, share, don't forget to ring the bell buttons for the next notification, three, like leave a comment subscribe four subscribe all right follow me on facebook and instagram remember gratitude is the best Attitude. Bye bye. See you again. Love you all.